what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back it's your boy terabyte reacts here with another reaction man back with some more god of high school hopefully you guys are enjoying the reaction as i said man two episodes in is not really anything for me to be um you know super 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 excited about but there is um when it comes on to the aesthetic of this anime the the animation is clean i like it um, in those aspects, but the story is yet to be seen. But two episodes in, it, it, you know, you're not gonna get that much information. So, in the last episode, in episode two, what we got to see was Jin versus Slipper Guy, Slipper's Jerk, or whatever. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Jin took him down with relative ease. You know what I'm saying? With relative ease, if 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 you don't mind me saying that. Um, you know, um, and that goes to show you too, because he kind of pulled out some superpower there at the end and Jin was still able to take him out with his reversal what was it reversal taekwondo was it renewal renewal taekwondo <laughs> you know what i'm saying triple kicks in the air which just kind of made me lose it because i was like not only i mean it's anime so you're gonna see impossible stuff all the time um you know what i mean but it was just crazy it was cool to see nonetheless so for me you know as i said before you know so far we haven't really seen a full fight with mirror we haven't seen a full fight with dan so it's it's like he was the first on the scene of the three main characters that we've actually seen like do something extraordinary so far and it also goes to show i don't know what Jin's punishment is going to be I'm looking forward to seeing what that is going to be if they're going to disqualify him or they're going to figure out something else or something it would be sad to see that he wouldn't be able to participate in the competition anymore because we all want to see who's going to be the finalist who's going to go to the nationals or whatever you know um also I kind of noticed that this it seems like this anime is based in Korea not japan i don't know why they have why they don't have like korean voice actors um i don't know i'm pretty sure that the, maybe I, I think the guy that created it is korean too so I, I i don't know um i mean he has kind of a korean name because park is usually like you usually get people that have korea with that name park so um so i don't know i <laughs> I don't know um uh, i'm just spitballing here but in any case we're gonna jump in we're gonna watch this episode three of god of high school and of course hopefully you guys have been enjoying the reactions man if you are leave a like on the video leave a comment of course and subscribe man what are you waiting on you know what i'm saying what are you waiting on to subscribe to the channel man i know you guys are enjoying these reactions i'm coming out I'm uploading videos to YouTube now and, and, and all this other stuff. So I'm not having any issues with God of High School. Hopefully everything else work, works out with the other series I'm planning to put on YouTube. But we'll see how things go. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much. I appreciate y'all. Let's go watch this reaction. And I'll see you for the review at the end. Let's go. Okay. Well, this is definitely a cult of sorts. How are you going to blame all of that on Jin? Okay. Ooh, 
rock bottom. Ooh. Well, damn. <laughs> okay, so you just a hoe. Okay. She just want to be piped down. Huh? Okay. Tougher than iron. That's a bit of an exaggeration. Ooh. How do you even get somebody in that position from where she was? <laughs> Oh, yeah? This thing is too loud. Oh! I'm pretty sure you guys can't, can't really hear me. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> anime, anime be so exaggerated sometimes. Just got him for free. Yeah, that's kind of weird, dude. Like, somebody who doesn't know you just gives you fruit and you don't think anything's wrong with it. God. Here we go with another dumb protagonist. Jeez. Isn't that the same thing that her father tells her? Do what you want? Because she said that to him. When they were looking for the sword. Oh, it's like a devil fruit, I guess. Buy right from One Piece. S The real deal or not? The heck?
Okay. He just hit him three times. There's no way Han is going to lose here. Oh, God. Don't you just hate the Ill Ill <laughs> the ones who can think they can win fights with intellect? <laughs> By studying. <laughs> it's like, I read your moves in a book. Okay. Oh. 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 I mean, he is from karate, karate, karate. What do you mean if he doesn't get tired of it? What kind of question is that? Is that a mistranslation? Because why would you ask somebody who has, it seems like he got cancer, like, don't you get tired of having cancer? Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay. 72 this time. Vermilion bird. Bruh, I wouldn't try to go fist to fist with nobody I just saw broke a bat with his fist, okay? This man's fist is breaking, is literally, oh my God. Damn, he's losing his mind. <laughs> oh, that animation, bro. Oh, this is a fourth stance. Yo, my guy, calm down. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, shit, he's still knocked out. Is this like something to, is this like something to, um, 
like awaken his power or something. I don't know. Holy, yo, it's over. What? <laughs> this dude must be mad, right? He got caught off guard. He didn't expect him to just. He's going to be pissed. Something is definitely different about him. What? Are they out here manifesting stands like JoJo? <laughs> That's crazy. Hmm? What happened? Ah, uh, damn. You're just a sore loser, dude. <laughs> Oh, so they know about him. You banana. All right, so that was episode three of The God of High School. And I'm. That was a this was good episode, seeing Mira finally fight and see Han, not Dan. I keep, I keep saying, I was saying Dan, right? So, Han. Han, I should say Han, right? Um, really went all out there. We kind of got a little bit more about his backstory and why he needs the money. I think he needs the money. To, he has two jobs and he's trying to win the tournament. I'm guessing to get the wish. So probably maybe they could use the nano machines on, on his friend and maybe fix what's going on with him. Um, so, um, you know, Hopefully things work out for, for Han, but there's other people who wants to win or who I want to see win. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't be, um, guy at this point, I don't see him, you know, he's strong, but I don't think he's as strong as Jin, especially now that whatever that park Mujin or whatever his name is did to Jin, like to, it seems like they awake, he awakened something in him. And I think that's what the fruit did. Uh, Cause it's like some special kind of fruit that probably awakened this thing that they're calling the Shariok or karaoke or whatever karaoke or whatever. Are you okay? Yeah. Um, so I don't know what. Still don't know. Three episodes in, still don't know what this story is going to be about. But they did mention Jin's grandfather, which I think Park probably knew him or he was a part of a previous tournament or something but i'm guessing the dude the dude the grandfather is a very legendary dude i'm guessing so that's why he probably let him do this with the administrator because he's like oh this is jin 
I think he's at Jin. I think I think his name is Tejin, Jin Tejin or whatever. Um, wow, I'm really, I, I don't know. I, I'm actually surprised that I'm remembering some of these names. Sometimes, <laughs> you know what I mean. I actually surprise myself sometimes when I'm when I'm watching stuff. So Jin, I think it's Jin Tejin. If I remember, if I read that right, and uh, remembering when when Park said it, um, you know, and also when it comes on to you know this whole grandfather thing and him being this tiger cub as he called it i'm guessing i'm, I'm guessing that maybe his grandfather have some sort of tiger style or, or something i don't know i don't know i'm just spitballing here trying to create something in my head as of a story because uh, as of now three episodes in there's really no story there you know what i'm saying it's just that we know about a tournament and that's about it we know that we know what our three main characters are are fighting for or what they're about jen wants to fight strong people mira wants to bring back you know honor to the family style of fighting the sword style and han wants to help out his friend he wants money to help out his friend it seems like his friend has cancer so i'm just gonna go with that but in any case guys i don't have much else to talk about here um because the story is progressing um and we're learning more about the tournament itself but at the same time as i said it's not anything too deep yet as i said i'm still in the process of watching this so three episodes is not enough for me to give you a verdict on the show per se and say oh it's terrible or whatever because right now i am enjoying it because when it comes on to animes that are like this if it's going to end up being like a dragon ball super situation or dragon ball um z kind of situation you know what i'm saying where it's just very fight centric and it's you know somebody trying to destroy the world and you know we got to stop them because they did show at the beginning of this episode a cult like i don't know what they're about they don't seem like they give a damn about the tournament because they turned off the radio right and they're about to start some foolishness so i don't know if this is going to end up being the same situation where the tournament gets interrupted and it's world domination and all of this other stuff and blah blah and ray ray you know what i'm saying if it's all about the if it's about the fighting and the fighting scenes and minimal amount of story I'm, I'll still like it because you guys know that I'm still going to watch it and like it. I just enjoy it for what it is, but it's not going to be something I'm going to be like, oh, it's in my top five because it's my least enjoyable type of genre when it comes on to, to, to anime. Like I'll watch Dragon Ball because I like the characters. I like the fighting. I like the key blasts. I like the moves. I like all of that stuff, but there's no story to Dragon Ball Z. There's, and worst of all in Dragon Ball that I don't like, there is no stakes. Nobody dies in Dragon Ball. Nobody dies. And if you do die, they just wish you back with the Dragon Ball. So as I said, they completely took out that part of Dragon Ball. And you just have to just enjoy what the fighting is because there's really no stakes. There's really no stakes. Until I see a villain comes along and just kills people and be like, the dragon balls don't matter because no matter what you wish for it and then they in super they introduced the super dragon balls which is like they you with anything you can do anything with those you can wish universes back with those dragon balls you know what i'm saying so it, it's just crazy the stakes are just completely out of it but if this anime introduced stakes it's still going to be enjoyable so i'm looking forward to that but in any case guys Thank you guys so much for tuning in. That is all I have to say about this episode. And I thank you guys so, so much. So hit the like button, of course. Leave a comment. And of course, subscribe if you're new. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate y'all. Terabyte is out. Peace.